You know, across the state, school districts are making some very difficult decisions about how to honor our graduating seniors this year. Well, tonight, our own Rich Nye spoke with school leaders and even students about the frustration of planning at all during the pandemic. Schools are choosing between virtual commencement ceremonies now or hoping for in-person ceremonies much later. Franklin Central opted for a televised virtual commencement May 22nd. Students can sign up for an individual diploma pickup, not the postponement senior Connor Grant wanted in his online petition that received over 3,000 signatures. You are all graduating together, and I think that's something very special and very important. And uh, for a lot of people, it's the only time that they get to experience something like that. Connor and a few of his classmates put together a proposal for a socially distanced commencement here at the football stadium later this summer. But they feel like the administration was not really interested. We feel like our voices weren't really listened to and what we wanted never really mattered. New Palestine administrators met with seniors and changed their plan to outdoor commencement July 11th with graduates spread out on the football field. We had already thought about we probably would have to go virtual and then we after that we talked among as administrators with our assistants and we said how can we do this differently to give them what they want somehow. Perry Meridian is sticking with its original commencement date but a virtual ceremony, May 21st. Two days later, graduates received diplomas in a drive through process. But we feel that frustration as well, and expressing that to, to our parents, to our students, uh, I think there's an understanding there that we've been able to develop collectively that we are limited. Chloe Lindsay graduated from Southmont in Crawfordsville in February, but still wants to walk the stage with her class. It wouldn't be the same for a virtual graduation. I mean, you wouldn't have all those people there you wouldn't have the same ex excitement. Maybe not this kind of excitement, but Southmont is leaning toward an outdoor commencement in July with better crowd control.